Hello students of Standard 10. Welcome once again in this YouTube channel of Mount Brescia. I am here with a new poem in English, How to Tell Wild Animals. This is the poem written by Caroline Wells, who was an American poet. This poet treats even this poet treats even ferocious animals and beasts with a coat of gentle but weird humor. humor. So this poem is a humorous poem. This poem is a humorous poem. Binod Priya, humorous, the word, the exact Hindi word of that humorous is Binod Priya. So, there are six stanzas in this poem, one by one stanza. I am going through and I will explain the stanzas accordingly with some new word meanings. Your first stanza says, If ever you should go by chance to jungles in the east, and if there should to you advance a large and towny beast if he roars at you if he roars at you as you are dying you will know it is an Asian lion so this is the stanza this style of the poem is humorous as I have told you this humorous poem suggests some dangerous way of identifying wild animals. How to identify the wild animals? This is a dangerous way. It says that if you go by chance, by chance, to the jungles of the east or the jungles of the country which is lying east, you will see a grand and majestic wild beast. If in those thick forests, if you see a large terrible animal with dark yellowish skin, with dark yellowish skin, you should be sure that he is the Asiatic lion. And if he roars loudly, and the roar terrifies you to death, then you are hearing the roar of an Asiatic lion. Means, if you go by chance in the countries of the east, in the countries in the east, and you pass through a jungle, suddenly you see yellow, yellowish color, a very great beast type of animal, wild animal, and if it roars at you, it's, it's roaring, makes you feel the death, feel that death is very near. You think that that is Asiatic lion. Here there are few words like uh, towny. Towny means brownish, the brownish hair of the lion. Other words are beast, that is wild animal. Other is roar. Roar is the sound of the that or the sound of that tiger lion is called roar. So these are the few words, and this is the first stanza explanation. Next stanza we will go through in our next video. In this way, there are six stanzas. First stanza today I have taught. Now, from the next video, I will be teaching you two two stanzas. Thank you.